Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel Learn with Sahira. In this video, I am going to give you the important questions for the subject Data Analytics and Essentials which is for degree first year, second semester, BCom Business Analytics students, okay? So all the students who are watching this video, you need to watch the video till end in order to get the, all the important questions. If you skip the video, then it will be of no use. So watch the video till end and if you are new to our channel Learn with Sahira, subscribe it for more videos and don't forget to share this video with your friends too if you want the notes of this subject you can text me on my instagram learn with sahira you text me there i will be giving you easy simple and clear to understand notes okay but note payment is must keeping this aside let us get started with our video data analytics and essentials most important questions so first we will be discussing or first we will be seeing long important questions they will then we will be going with the short important questions okay from unit wise we are going to see so from unit number one first important question is what do you mean by categorical variables and explain its subcategories this is the first important question from unit number one. Second one is explain the types of variables in data analytics Third one is distinguish means differences between discrete and continuous variable with example. Whenever they are mentioning you example, you need to write the example dots. That's all. If you don't write the example, your marks will be deducted. Explain the difference between interval and ratio variables with example. So these are the four important questions from the unit number one. Then from unit number two, important questions are what are the components of central tendency? Second one is explain the steps involved in calculation grouping table of mode. Third one is explain the method of calculation of standard deviation and variance. Okay. Fourth one is identify the steps in calculation of geometric mean and harmonic mean. And also you make sure you practice arithmetic mean median mode GM. HM, AM, sorry, AM, median, mode, GM and HM, standard deviation, coefficient of variation and CV related problems from unit number 2. Make sure you pro, uh, practice the problems, ma, please. Okay. Then from unit number 3, first important question is, explain various types of events in probability. Write about addition theorem and multiplication theorem. What is probabilistic tree diagram? Explain its parts and uses. Explain the procedure to calculate probability from a contingency table. Explain the procedure to calculate probability from when diagramming and its application. These are the five important questions from unit number three. From unit number four, first important is explain Poisson's distribution and its uses. Define normal distribution and its, explain its importance. The differences between discrete probability distribution and continuous probability distribution. What is binomial distribution and explain its properties or features. What are the properties of normal distribution. So these are the five important questions from unit number four. And make sure you practice the problems or binomial distribution, poison distribution and normal distribution. Okay, make sure you practice the problems. Especially I am mentioning here. Then from unit number 5 and the last unit, a first important question is define R programming and what are the different data objects or types in R. Okay, what do you create, uh, sorry, how do you create histogram and box plot in R language? You need to discuss or explain. How do you make a scatter plot with basic R? Explain its code. Explain R functions with suitable examples. In R language, how to get a structure of data frame, extra data from data frame, central tendency and dispersion formulas. So you need to be perfect with these five questions from unit number five. We have seen five units long important questions now let us go with the short important questions from each unit from unit number one it is what is numeric variables then categorical variable nominal variable then variable and its nature what do you mean by continuous and discrete variables so the uh, questions related to variables will be given in unit number one from unit number two we are having what is mode range and coefficient of range what is weighted mean and how it is calculated Define standard deviation, measures of central tendency like median, mean and mode, then variance and coefficient of variance. So these are the important questions, short important questions from unit number two. Then from unit number three, we have probability and uh, what is random experiment, what is conditional probability, 
सैंपल स्पेस इवेंट ऑफ प्रोबेबिलिटी जॉइंट प्रोबेबिलिटी बेस थियरम एंड व्हाट इज वेन डायग्राम सो दिस आर द सिक्स शॉर्ट इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम यूनिट नंबर थ्री फ्रॉम यूनिट नंबर फोर आई गेव यू व्हाट इज प्रोबेबिलिटी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन व्हाट इज स्कीवनेस व्हाट आर द पॉपुलर प्रोबेबिलिटी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन व्हाट आर द एजम्स ऑफ पॉइजन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन फ्रॉम यूनिट नंबर फाइव एंड द लास्ट क्वेश्चन आर वॉट इज आर एनालिटिक्स वॉट आर द आर विक्टर फंक्शन हाउ टू यू और हाउ डू यू क्रिएट a user defined function in r what is a data frame so these are the four important questions from unit number 5 so we have seen long as well as short important questions from each and every unit it will be more than enough for you to score good marks in this subject examination no doubt in that so make sure you are perfect with all the questions and if you are finding any difficulty or if you are having any doubts let me know in the comment section if you want the notes text me on my instagram learn with sahira but note payment is must See you all in the next video all the very best bye bye